G'day! Today I'm going to be showing you how to get the sword or the katana, whatever you want to call it, in the forest. That's right, this way that I'm doing is completely easy, you don't have to fight anything, it's flaming easy. So that means you can really get off the plane, head on over here and get yourself a kick-ass weapon on any difficulty so early on in the game. So anyway, let's jump right into it. So I'm currently standing near the cave that I want to access, and I'm just sort of looking around so you can sort of get your bearings. So if you stumble upon this, you'll know where you are. So there is the ocean out that way. It comes in the mouth of the river, and it sort of splits off into like an X pattern here. And you sort of want to come up the embankment, come right up here where I am, and here's the cave entrance in question. So if you were to go any other way, you'd actually have to fight an armsy and a couple of tough cannibals. So you don't want to do that. This is the easiest way you can do. As I said, look, I'm doing it with pretty much nothing on me. Right off the plane, a fresh spawn. So easy. So anyway, let's go ahead and head on down. So it's going to get pretty dark. That's right, it's going to get pretty dark as we go down. So I'm going to probably adjust my brightness in post-rendering so you guys can see a lot easier. It's not going to affect me, but you guys should see a hell of a lot easier than I can. So let's go ahead and slide down the rope here. It's actually quite the distance, isn't it? Flame and galah. All right, we've hit the bottom. I'm going to go ahead and uh, get some light for myself here. There we go. So we've hit the bottom here. All right, so as soon as we hit the bottom, we, we pretty much look to our right here, and you've got some cloth on the ground. Um, you could go ahead and collect collect any of this stuff. I don't really need it, but you want to sort of work your way up to this rope here. You will start to hear some very nasty noises. Don't worry. Relax. They will not see you. you we're going to stealth right past them. That's right. We're stealthing right past them. So let's go ahead and go up. That's the armsy and the couple of crazy cannibals I was talking about earlier. So up, up we go. And you'll see this poor fella hanging from the roof here. That's okay. So you don't want to go to your right. Repeat, do not go to your right. Go to your left from the hanging dude. Okay, so we're going to our left and we're just going to pretty much head on down the side here. Head on down. So we pretty much just bypassed. We went around the armsy and the cannibals and keep following uh, keep following the wood planks. That's all you got to do. It's pretty much a nice road. Oh, there we go. I ran out of light there. Go ahead and light that back up a couple there. There you go. All right. So also where we're going, you're going to get like watches and money and all sorts of good stuff as well. So keep on going in. There we go. It'll get a bit tight in here. Just sort of squeeze through. Keep on going. Oh, here, all that water. I'm currently not sprinting. You can sprint. We can sprint, actually. Sprint away. You should start to... You, you will go through the hanging finger forest, which is kind of scary. Um, crouch at the end here, and you'll see a skull lantern. Yep, there you go. And as soon as you see this skull lantern, turn to your right. And here you are. Look at all this. So I'm going to go ahead and light this fire up, just to give us some more light here. There we go. So look at all this cash. Look at this. You got flares. You've got some more food. You got a guy's head. Poor guy. Uh, more food. Watches. Flame and glove. But what you want is the sword itself. Ching. There we go. We have got ourselves the katana. How easy was that? Flame and easy. Just make sure you gather all the stuff up here before you go ahead and head back. See, grab it all up. So you've got drinks just until you're full. And that's literally how easy it is. So I'm going to go... There's also some fuel over here for a chainsaw. If you've got a chainsaw. And then I'm going to go ahead and head back. So here's the hanging skull again. I'm going to get out my uh, my axe here. So let's go ahead and uh, throw some of that up. And I'll just show you the way out. It's very simple stuff. This is right as you get off the plane, you can actually head down here. So back through the, the finger forest here. And we're going to sprint out now. Just keep following this until you see the wood again. And follow that wood. Or the planks, whatever you want to call them. And here they are. You'll still hear stomping and cannibals making grunting noises. Don't worry. 
relax. Just keep heading up the same way that you come in. Don't panic. Oh, there's the there's a board there. There we are. Up we go. And there's the hanging guy. Just go straight to the hanging guy. Look, he's not even up here. See? Hanging guy. Let's go ahead and head back down. Now remember, once you slide down the rope, he can no cannibals or no armsies can get down this rope. So you're safe. It's a safe zone. He can make all that flame and noise he wants. But at the end of the day, yeah, it ain't doing nothing. And here's the exit. How easy was that, guys? So, yeah, go ahead and start the, the horrible climb back up. But there you go. Something very easy to get you off the plane. Go get a kick-ass weapon. And then off on our adventure you go. Now, guys, if you if you enjoyed the tutorial, make sure you smash the buttons. Leave me a comment below. Check out some of my other stuff. I've got a modern axe uh, uh, tutorial as well. All sorts of other stuff. Um, and do me the biggest favor. Share this on your favorite social media. Come on, I'm nearly there. <laughs> oh, such it's such a climb. It is such a climb. And it makes it even scarier because it's so dark. But hopefully for you guys, the brightness was it was was increased so you could see a little better than I could. And we have daylight. That's literally how easy that was. Flame and galah. Brilliant. Now just remember, guys, this is a very heavily patrolled area. So be careful. Watch your bum. That's right. Heavily patrolled area, so you don't want to be standing around for too long. Alright, guys. I'll catch you all later.